Good morning, guys. My name's Emily Warburton Adams. Excuse my completely au natural look. I have pretty much just rolled out of bed. Um, today, I'm going to be the official correspondent for Lifetime TV at the Britain's Next Top Model launch party tonight. So, I thought I would give you a little insight into what this kind of day is like and what I get up to. So stay tuned for that because I'll also be showing you backstage and some sneaky peeks when I go to the event. I'm going to go on a run and then come back and do my floor exercises. I've done some yoga stretching because I do that every morning just as a mind release. <laughs> and um, yes, so I'll check back in with you later. Hello again. Um, I just got back from my run. Now the kettle is boiling. My laptop is on and I'm going to do some YouTube editing before I have to wash my hair for the hairdresser to come over. Hello, so I've had my hairdresser Taryn arrive who is an absolute miracle worker when it comes to my white girl afro. <laughs> um, and so we'll see how she does my hair. Excuse my bathrobe. Taryn has just finished my hair. I feel like I look like a new person. It's always so amazing having a blow dry. And how good is she? I want to get in. Everyone will have probably seen this beautiful lady on my Instagram things. She's one of my oldest friends and her name is Hannah and she will be doing my makeup. Hey! <laughs> How beautiful is she? <laughs> and she's coming to the event with me and I've known her since we were tinkly tots at primary school. Um, so yeah, she's going to be doing my makeup. So exciting. From this bare au naturel look. Yeah. We'll see what it's like at the end. Definitely. <laughs> Okay, so Hannah's just finished my makeup. How Yay. incredible is it? I just like, I feel like a new person. I'm so looked after. Um, now we're going to get dressed, even though the cab's outside now. <laughs> um, and go. We're now in the car on the way there, rather late, but we'll get there on time because we've Hopefully, with London traffic, we've been given an hour to get there, that and what, now late, it's an hour. But, you know. Yeah, and we've got our little coffees here and mm. <laughs> with the straw, so that it doesn't mess up the makeup. Um, and we'll see what entails. I'm just going over the questions, and it's rather daunting because I haven't done it like this before. And I received the questions yesterday, but hopefully it's all good. I'm wearing my lovely Noelle um, jewelry and a Lessie dress and Hannah's looking very authentic and stunning in a very colourful kimono. Thanks, hey. Look at the bag as well. And my <laughs> shoes, show them your shoes. I'm I'm happy sure both my shoes. Yes. Look at them. And then mine up here as well. Lovely gold. You can see them. Yeah, that's not a girl. I don't know if you can see them, but yeah. <laughs> there we go. Mm -hmm. So Hannah and I are now at the venue and we've met all the girls and they're lovely and they're there's lots going on back behind the scenes before everyone arrives. Lots of snapping going away in the background there. It's all quite cool. So all the setup is going on in here at the moment. They've got a really cool stage here and it's going to be a show. And then over here they've got a really cool live graffiti board in the back end there, so that's all going to be getting quite rocky later.
So I just got back, well I got back about an hour ago. What an incredible night, it was amazing, it was so fabulous to meet all the girls, that was so lovely, um, so it's nice meeting other people who have been on reality TV shows and things because it is very mentally challenging and it's an experience that's hard, that is hard to relate to if you haven't done it. Um, so much fun, I loved it. and. One thing I can say is, this time last year, I would not have had the confidence to do that. Um, and, I mean, partially feeling confident about my mouth and having my teeth done has really helped. So, I mean, I have to give that to TLC. Like, I wouldn't be able to do it without. And just from, you know, life experience over the past year, what I've actually been through, because um, it's totally different from anything else I've ever done. And... Um, I feel like so lucky for everything and I couldn't imagine myself being here like a year ago, you know, two years ago, like miles off um, and it's so funny how life can just change that quickly, I mean it can change in a day so rapidly, I can like think of many occasions where I'd say that but you know in this case over the year what can change, it's incredible and I'm enjoying being on this journey so much wherever it leads to because I used to be so worried about where my destination was actually going and where I was going to end up and what I was doing, you know, what the end goal was and I've learned that that isn't, it's not all about that, it's really about the journey and I'm a lot more laid back with that, which is nice, embrace life and every day. Um, and just see where the journey takes you. Um, just work hard along the way and that's what I try and do. Um, but yeah, fabulous opportunity, amazing experience, um, so much fun, met amazing people and I'm shattered. So I'm going to go to sleep now and I hope you've enjoyed the little snippet and watching. And um, Check back in soon. Night night.